happy Friday. So it is actually Friday when you are watching this and it is Friday when I am filming this, but it's a week earlier. <laughs> I am so glad it's Friday. My job right now is so stressful. So it's year in for schools. I'm a commercial interior designer if you're new here. Also subscribe if you're new here. My name's Mariah. Um, it's year in for schools right now. And so schools are like trying to spend all of their money so that they can get or like all the money that they're allotted for new furniture and stuff like that so that they can get it installed by the end of summertime like before kids come back <laughs> it's crazy it's so crazy so like my boss has the flu right now and she was still on a conference call this morning like she sounded pitiful bless her heart but uh you know you win some you lose some you gotta you gotta do what you gotta do in this job um, my friend is getting married like literally the day that you're watching is my friend will be getting married and I had to take off because like we're going to Savannah for it and I'm like I'm not even sorry because I'm so excited for her wedding but oh my gosh like it's a horrible time so it's okay but it's just been kind of a stressful day so I wanted to update you guys on that whole shipping debacle that I was telling you about the other day I have the worst luck of any human when it comes to shipping everything always goes wrong but I don't mind it like it's just not it's it's out of my control so it's not something that I can like sit around and fuss about I would still much rather online shop than shop in stores so let me put this down my hand's getting really tired I feel like I'm forever standing in my kitchen when I vlog but that's just where the lighting's really good so um I told you guys I had I think it was maybe about my vlog camera I think and then the jewelry so my if you didn't watch my last vlog I'll link it right here but jewelry was supposed to come on Monday it was coming from Johns Island South Carolina came up to the Greenville hub which is the hub that my like mail comes out of and then it went back to Charleston <laughs> and then it came back to Greenville and I was like uh, package what you doing so it finally gets here right it was these rings the Everly rings I like them they're pretty they're cool I just like adding like fun little bands to my wedding set every now and then just to kind of change it up um, I mean it's just fun and they're super affordable I'll link them in the description bar below so I got my rings right and that same day I had forgotten I ordered a bikini that pink bikini that I shared on my main channel in my Amazon haul I love that bikini so much that I bought it in black. Half the bikini came in. I'm literally not joking. Like, I opened the package and I was like, oh, okay, this is the bathing suit top. And I looked and there was nothing else. And I was like, okay, so I guess I just paid for half a bathing suit. And that was really annoying because, like, I paid the same amount of money as I did for the whole pink bathing suit. So I messaged them on Amazon and they're like prime verified so they're like really responsive the store um that sells bathing suit and they were super quick and they're like we're so sorry we don't know what happened do you want us just to send you the bikini the full bikini and i was like no just send me the bottoms well then it turns out the um black was out of stock which they were like that's probably what happened is like our stock person just didn't pay attention but that bathing suit the bottoms are out of stock so it's out of stock now online and they were like, do you want us to send you another color? And I was just like, no. So they actually refunded me. And I always feel really bad when companies refund me because then I'm like, but I have your stuff. Like, do a partial refund or something. But anyway, so then my vlog camera, um, initially it was supposed to be here on May 7th. And I got a thing that it had shipped. And I was so excited. I was like, yes, it's going to be here before May 7th. So excited. And then it has sat in New York for like three days now so it's probably gonna be here on the 7th <laughs> I was so sad so I just have horrible luck but I did get two things from dress up let me show them to you guys they are so cute hold on. so dress up is I think there's a store in Gainesville Georgia I think that's where they're based out of so dress up is a boutique they have adorable stuff and I've known that like I've heard of dress up I bought a graduation dress from dress up two years ago and I was like, you know, great, cute stuff. But I it, I don't know, I've just never gravitated back towards it because, I don't know, I just, I have it. Um, so then the other day I saw something, I don't know if it was on Pinterest or Instagram, and it was from Dress Up. And I was like, I should just see what they have. Usually boutiques, though, they're very expensive. Even like the more affordable boutiques are expensive. You guys, their motto on that website is literally everything is under $50. And they get like 
I don't want to go big here and say 60, so maybe it was like 16 new arrivals each week, but it might be 60. Like, they get a ton of new stuff. So I bought the prettiest, softest, best-fitting gray maxi for $18. This is a maxi dress. It is super soft, feels like pajamas. I am 5'9", and it fits perfectly on me in flats. I could probably wear like a 2-inch heel, so if you're shorter... I got a medium, by the way. You would probably have to wear just like a few inches um, uh, high heels, but usually that's not a problem for people, especially if you're wearing a maxi dress or you can get it hemmed. Like, it is so soft. I seriously want to go buy it all. I think it comes in four colors. I think it's like navy, green, black, and gray, and this is the gray. I want to go buy it in all the other colors. So then I also bought just a basic t-shirt. They shipped this stuff so fast. I think I ordered it two days ago. No, I live in South Carolina, so may not be the same if you're, you know, ordering something from out west, but um, South Carolina and Georgia are right next to each other, so I kind of got lucky with the fast shipping. But then I just bought, like, a basic pink tee. It's, like, crew neck. There's nothing special about it, but it is the softest, like, top ever. So I'll link these in the description bar below, but I was just very confused on why I've never shopped at this place before, apart from, like, many years ago, because their stuff is so soft, so soft and so affordable. So I'm excited about that, but <sighs> Sam is supposed to be home soon. It's after work hours, and I don't know where he is. Probably got distracted at work, and he's still working. So what he does. All right, I'm going to start cleaning soon. want to tell you guys that. So you saw in my last vlog, if you watched it from Monday, I cleaned the kitchen and dining room. Today I'm tackling the bathroom and the laundry room. It's great. It's going to be so fun. Yay. All right, so you guys know that I am all about some flowers. I literally have fake flowers, <laughs> like four, five, I know I have one in my office, six. Uh, there would be one in Sam's office if he would let me. So there would be like seven different things of fake flowers in my house if I had control over it. But I have to do fake flowers most of the time because um, I... I, I would prefer real flowers, but I have to do fake flowers most of the time because my cats like to eat them. Real, fake. They still try to eat them. Um, but I'm really sick of, like, cleaning up petals and stuff from real flowers. So, I don't know if I've ever told you guys. So, there's an Airbnb literally right next to our house. And I know the owners. <sighs> I don't like revealing this much information, which is why I'm, like, stuttering a lot and kind of talking weird. Um, I know the owners... I'm going to leave it at that. But there is peonies over there. And so I was told I could go cut some. And I'm going to go cut them. And I don't care if my cat eats them all. I'm taking my pretty vase. And I'm going to cut some peonies for me. Fun fact. I wanted peonies and hydrangeas for my wedding flowers. And my florist was like, mm-mm, you're not getting those. And I loved my florist for that very reason. She said, I would give you that because that's what you want. But I'm going to tell you, they're going to die. My florist was like, they will die before your wedding day even gets started. Like, you will have dead flowers. So, it's your choice. And I was like, no, I don't want dead flowers. And it ended up being the hottest freaking day of the year. They would have died. And actually, the flowers that she did use, like, she had to watch them. Like, they literally had them inside and were sitting on the dining room table when they were trying to, like, set up everything. Um... We got married in an old, like, uh, plantation-style home, and so they had this big dining table where they were setting up all the food, and, like, the floor sat there and was watching them, and she was like, I just don't want them to be exposed to the heat too quickly, and I had the best florist in the world, so I'm glad she told me no, because they would have totally died. 100%. They would have all died. Um, and most, most flowers die, like, in the direct heat, obviously, but, like, apparently hydrangeas, like, wilt really quickly if they're in the direct sun. I'm gonna go over there. I'm gonna steal me some peonies. So, let's see if we can do this. This is outside my house, like right outside of it. Y'all, look at my hair. Woo! 
That wind, oh my gosh. Okay, so I ended up, there weren't as many as I thought there were gonna be. I don't know what I thought there was gonna be. Um, uh, I brought a bug inside, I brought a bug inside, I brought a bug inside, okay, okay. I don't know how many I thought there were gonna be, but like there just weren't that many. So I know that there will be a ton more like this summer, there will be a lot more like blooming. So I am just going to put these in some water. They're very pretty, all of them. There's not that many, like literally there's four. There's, okay, I need the smaller vase. This is the pretty vase that I got. I'll see if I can still link it below for you guys because I always get questions about stuff like that, but like 99% of my vases, actually I think 100% of them, were gifts from my wedding registry. Okay, that's pretty. This one needs some love. See, look, just like a simple, pe oh, I'm so sorry. Simple peony bush, like very elegant. I love these, oh my gosh. So I also got this one. Ain't she pretty? She's real pretty. I love peonies. Oh my gosh. I just don't understand how like a flower can be that pretty. I don't get it. I'm just a I'm just a mess. I just made the biggest mess in the world. Ah! Oh no. No, that's a big bug. That's a big bug. That's a big oh. Eh. Okay. I'm gonna put some of those pink flowers in here. I'm gonna see how many I can get without bringing bugs inside. Oh, I don't want that. So, got all these. This is actually, I didn't realize how purple the peony was. So these have thorns on them, which is fabulous. I love, love thorns. Um, but no bugs, which is good. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna make sure that they all look good, that there aren't any leaves on them. And then I'm going to go ahead and um, probably put these in the center of my table. So I don't think I've mentioned it. I actually am filming a video like this weekend, so it will have already gone up on my main channel when you guys are watching this vlog. I'm filming a video on how to spruce up your home for spring because I've got a lot of requests on it. It's simple things that aren't gonna cost you a ton of money, but they're gonna make your home look really, really good. Goodness, that wind, oh my gosh. Every time I call out, my hair looks a little crazier when I come back. All right, so see, just look how pretty. So pretty, and you like, can kind of see the water underneath, but you see some pink too. Hold on. That's so good. So I'm not finished setting up the table and everything for spring, but you can see it just definitely like brings a little pop to it. It's super pretty. I ended up putting a lot in there. They're, I think they're coming off a little bit more red on um, camera than they are in person. They're like a pretty pink. So I just love the way it looks, but we'll see if our kitties eat them. And then our messy living room, there's the peonies. Hey friends, so I wanted to um, jump on really quick and finish out this vlog. So I'm about to get started on my work day. I actually, here, let me turn a little bit. Got a little bit of weird glare. So Sam and I actually merged offices. Um, we both work from home now like 60% of the time. And so we wanted to spend more time together like when we were actually home. And so he's like, right there and then I'm right here really don't talk much but we're in the same room and that's just my love language so it works for me um but I also want to let you guys know I got nothing done this weekend like I was going to clean all weekend and do a clean with me in this vlog and Saturday we ended up hanging out with friends and Sunday we hung out with family so <laughs> we got literally nothing done but it's okay because sometimes you know you just have to you just gotta scratch your plans and just hang out with friends and family because you can clean anytime but you won't always have those moments with friends and family. So I'm about to, it's almost eight o'clock. So I'm going to get started on my work now. Thanks guys so much for watching. Make sure to go below and subscribe if you are new here. Thank you guys so much for 8,000 on my main channel. I'm so grateful. I don't know what I did to deserve that. And then for 550 um, on this channel. So I'm really excited. 
super tired and I've got to get started on this work. So we'll chat later.